Hello, Dr. Fawkes here. I've had a question from a Year 6 student about candles. She asks, how does a candle burn? Well, I'm glad you asked me that question because quite a lot of students fail to understand that it's the wax in the candle that makes the candle burn. Firstly, I need to explain what a candle is. It is a piece of wax with a bit of string or a wick running through the middle of it. I'm going to light the candle. When I light the candle, the heat from the flame starts melting the wax. And we can see some of the wax drip. But what you often don't see is that some of the wax at the surface here is turning into a gas, into wax vapour. And those vapours rise up and it's those vapours that are burning. The wick is really only here to keep the flame in the right place. And I'm going to try and show you a, a little demonstration that will allow you to see that it is the vapours of wax that are burning and not just the wick. After you blow out a candle, there is a little trail of smoke and gas vapour that rises upwards. You can set light to that vapour and it will burn back to the candle. So, the flame melts, the wax uh, turns into a liquid, and although some of that wax will drip, some of it also evaporates or boils, and it's the gas from the wax that actually causes the flame to burn. Now in that reaction, the fuel and the oxygen turn to carbon dioxide and water vapour. And that's the same for all fuels, or almost all fuels. I hope that was clear to you. Thank you very much for the question. Talk to you again soon. Well, thank you again. And you're